Hi Capricorn, it's Elle here to do your September 2018 general reading. It's a general read, so it will not resonate with every Capricorn who views the video, but if it does resonate with you, like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Um, it's Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, whatever, you know, it's up to you. Uh, let's start off with love. I hope that everyone is has had a really good August. Today is August 27th, so closing out August and jumping into September. So we're gonna do a five card advice spread. The first card is you, right where you are. The second card is are you on your correct path? The third card is your main obstacle. The fourth card is what's helping you. And the fifth card is how can progress be made? Put those back. How can progress be made? Okay, two cards wanted to come out. Bottom of the deck, ooh, the seven of swords. All right, so this is you right where you are. The five of swords. Hmm. Trying to stand up for yourself, doing verbal battle, uh, dealing with maybe jealousy, outside interference, maybe a third party. This is the battle where no one wins, you know? It's just the whole big debacle. Are you in your correct path? The Wheel of Fortune, it says that the wheel is turning in your favor. If you're not on your correct path, stay at it. Stick at what you're doing because your hard work is paying. It's going to pay off. Um, yes, it's been tough. Yes, it's been hard. Yes, you've had to fight, but it's going to pay off. Your main obstacle here is the lovers. It could be a Gemini or it could just be the fact that you need to make a choice in whatever it is you want to do. Maybe with two people, maybe with two very real options. And this is love, so it could be two people. It could be two two options. You know, what 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 do you want to do? Do you want to stay? Do you want to go? Are you going with this person? Are you, you know, what, what are you doing? Are you choosing to be single? You have to make a choice here. There's definitely interference, maybe even a third party. Whatever is happening here is supposed to happen. Um, what is this card? I forgot. <laughs> Does that a mind? My mind go blank. Um, was helping you the magician you being able to manifest whatever it is you want you being able to manipulate this situation Capricorn is good at that you being able to manipulate this situation to your liking to what is best for you um, you're able to bring down what is is meant for you with the will of fortune to bring it down even faster um, to bring it to fruition Some of you are dealing with a partner who is partnered. You want this person and it looks like you're trying to get them. Some of you might even be doing some type of ritual magic. I don't know. Um, how can progress be made? The death card. Okay. And the emperor. Someone needs to put an end to... So you, Capricorn, you may be dealing with someone who's older than you, much older than you. You might need to put an end to this situation with them or they need to put an end to be the situation of being someone's husband. They need to make a choice. You need to make a choice, Capricorn. Yeah, because someone is sneaking, lying, cheating, being deceptive. Once again, he runs off with five swords. Five of swords. He leaves two there. Then I'm, it's definitely a situation where someone's just trying to take or get what they can get out of the situation being manipulative. But the situation needs to either transform and change completely or just end it. Because this person is not going to ever change. They've done a lot to get here and they're much older. Let's see. 
Let's do career and finance for Capricorn. Let's get some career and finance messages for Capricorn. Career and finance messages for Capricorn. Right, bottom of the deck, the Five of Cups. Some of you still having grief from the loss of maybe a long-standing financial situation, maybe uh, due to being in a marriage, you, you were comfortable financially, or you were at a, a, a job for a long period of time, and you guys, um, you guys got let go, or you left, or so, something of of that nature five of cups yeah and you're still worried about it. you're still in grief about that it still haunts you emotionally you haven't really talked about it. you haven't really dealt with the emotions of being either pushed out, let go, um, being let go and pushed out of a marriage. Right, let's see. But it, it it's messing with you financially. Six of Swords. It looks like you're going to get to a better, more placid, peaceful place. Eight of Swords. But still feeling stuck and tied to maybe an old way of doing things. Nine of Pentacles. Nice. Independent. Um, abundant. Ace of Swords, you'll have that new foundational start, but it's going to come by way of ending. Um, Sagittarius had both of these cards in love and in career and finance. It looks like you get quote unquote set right, or you get by way of this ending, you'll have victory. It might even be a, a divorce. You may get what you want in this divorce, where it takes you to the Nine of Pentacles, where you're um, financially stable, abundant, and independent. But you don't know how this is going to turn out. For some of you, it's you might be leaving an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You feel stuck and tied to this person because you have children with them. You're the financially independent one. Or this Gemini, Libra, Aquarius still feels stuck to you because you part of the financially independent one Capricorn but you you want to speak your truth and put it into this situation so that your financial situation can get, can get better for some of you it's a divorce you're waiting on judgment you're waiting on you know what your financial life will look like after divorce you're still crying over spilled milk over what it used to be Let's get some angel answers in here. Someone moved away from you. Or you moved away from someone else. Either mentally or physically. Somebody moved out of the home. Someone's concerned about having to move out of a home. Someone's concerned about being blindsided by this person. Okay, within the next few weeks is at the bottom of the deck. So if you have a question about, you know, timing within the next few weeks, recovery. Yeah, you guys are going to get your recovery. It's going to take you to the Nine of Pentacles where you have enough money to be financially independent in the near future. You're ready. Nice. Be assertive. We're certain about what you want and what you expect within the next few weeks. Let's get some butterfly oracle cards in here. Let's 
some of you want to be free of a situation you you have your your options are open you probably already have someone on the side you want to be free of a marriage or a long-standing relationship that brings you a lot of that has a lot of obligation attached to it leaving get some rest decisions volunteer forgiveness motivation those were all the ones that flipped over at the bottom of the deck parental care now either you're a parent you need to enact parental care with your own children or you might need to go backwards and you might need to check on your parents and really um have some parental care there all right some of you like i said some of you are leaving you want to leave you are leaving there's an ending here you don't want to be someone's husband a provider guide anymore some of you need to get some rest you've been doing a lot you've been working a lot you have some of you haven't you know you need to make a decision here with the lovers some of you need to volunteer information you need to speak up you need to be assertive of course volunteer being you know being charitable doing your alms benevolent work so forth some of you need to ask for forgiveness or you need to forgive someone else this might be your stumbling block in getting to the next phase in life the next chapter have a motivation motivation to do whatever it is you're trying to do but do have the motivation uh, motivation comes from desire passion um, if there's lack of that then we know that you're not that invested okay all right so if this reading resonated with you Capricorn, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Get in the comments below and let let the community know what's going on with you. You may be going through the same thing another Capricorn is going through um, across the world, which I think is so dynamic and so coincidental. Like that's it, it's it's mind blowing that we could be going through the same thing. And sometimes it's helpful. And it's it's been. It brings you a bit of solace and comfort knowing that you aren't the only one out there. Anyhow, if you want to request a personal reading, all of my information is below. Take advantage of the $20 two-question reading, all right? Know that I'm praying for you, Capricorn. Pray for me as well. I'll talk to you in October. Bye.